hello hi Gemini welcome back to the channel it is always a blessing to have you guys back here now if you are here for your first time I welcome you and if you are returning back to the channel I welcome you guys back with open arms you know you're a diamond please continue to shine bright and beautiful like a diamond all right so Gemini we're gonna get into a prayer because on this channel there's always a prayer here um, this is going to be your next 48 hours okay all right, so let's get into a prayer, you guys. Heavenly Father, as I come before you, ask for your blessings for myself and for my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, so gems, just know that this reading is a general, not a personal reading. Um, with that being said, it may resonate with you, and then again, it may not. Um, your person who is your person who came to thought. Or your situation is your situation ship that first came to thought, okay? Just place it where you need to place it. Cross watchers are more than welcome to be a part of these reads. Do not force your reads. Send it back to the universe, you guys. What didn't resonate, just let it go. Let it fly like a bird in the sky. If you guys are interested in having a personal reading with me, you could always connect with me using the information that I provided for you guys, and that will always be in the description of this video. I do not hold appointments for anyone. It is a first come, first serve, okay? Um, you pay for your reading, and your reading is always yours you can always reschedule uh, but there's absolutely no refund okay you guys all right <clears throat> all right angels tapping into the energy please tap into the energy of gemini in their situation um everything that i need to share with gems at this time what's the message for gems please what this gems needs to know right now Okay, so right now, Gems, I'm hearing, you know, meeting you was the best thing that ever happened to me. Okay, um, I feel like someone made a mistake, though. I'm hearing I made a mistake. Um, how can I make it up? So I feel like, you know, this person, um, and just know that your person is your person, past, present, or future. Okay, but this person is saying, you know, I'm truly sorry. You're the best thing that ever happened to me. Um, you know, I resonate with you. You resonate with me. You know, I'm feeling your vibes. I know you're feeling my vibes. I'm, I'm, di I'm digging into chemistry with you. I know you're digging back right into chemistry with me. We have a sexual passion between each other. Um, we make each other laugh. We make each other smile. But I messed up. I messed up. Even though you're everything and more, I messed up. Even though you are... The one that I saw myself with forever. I messed up. I've made mistakes. How can I fix it? So this person wants to fix this. Okay. They want to fix it. This person wants to fix it. They want to make things right. Um, with you, but really don't know how to make it right. I feel like they're, you know, they could be this person is dealing with people who's trying to have this connection go further apart. Um, or whatever this could be. Well, let's see. What is this? Purify this, please. What is making it so difficult for a Gemini person to make things right? Okay. So there's a lover's card here. All right. So, hmm. Okay. So there seems to be like some kind of a third party situation that is coming in. Is what I'm hearing. I feel like this person, this third party person, maybe tried to do some kind of a love spell or something. Um, some this person might have tried to bury this relationship. Someone wants this relationship dead and over with. Okay, someone feels like this person is not good enough for you, or they're good enough for this person. Um, I really feel like you know this your person might have been blindsided by something here. But whatever I'm here, I'm hearing karmic. So somebody fell into a karmic situation here. Someone had a piece of a pie that wasn't supposed to be eaten. It could have been a badass a bad apple. Or something but someone went into a situation without kind of seeing and now they're buried into something stuck I'm hearing justice or job or job judification here so I'm hearing separation you guys okay your next body I was just giving me a separation all right um for some of you this could be court situation okay so but somebody's unbothered I'm hearing that there's something that's going on here that really wants you to be bothered, but you're not. That wants you to be concerned, but at this point, you're not. 
In the reverse, you're not concerned. In the reverse, you don't give a shit. In the reverse, you don't even care right now. Okay, um, I'm hearing somebody just maybe trying to just get some things situated. This mature woman is also in the reverse. Her energy is de depleted, done with, over with. Someone is lost here. Okay, I'm hearing a marriage is over or ended. If this is not your marriage and they're connected to someone else who's married, something is ending here. Something is not going right. Clarify this, please. Okay, so that's confirmation. This main male is either dealing with financial hardship. They're either not knowing that direction. They're either very unstable or very unbalanced here. Very confused, not knowing where to choose or what to do or lost. Someone is moving away or someone is making it happen for sure. Someone doesn't want to suffer and struggle anymore. Dealing with financial hardship, it is over. It's ending here. But someone wants to be with you. Courtship. But someone is making it difficult for this person to give you what they really truly want. There's a gift that wants to come in, but someone doesn't really know. Yeah, somebody's doing a spell work here to make sure that this relationship is in a coffin. Buried. Done with. Over it. It's a wrap. Done. Sudden wealth. So someone is making sure that they come out on top. They come out the, on the winner. This could be that this person. Yeah, this is courthouse situation. Yeah. It's very toxic. This person is. Their intentions is bad. I'm hearing karma. So somebody is going to be dealing with some kind of a karma here or something. Okay. Whatever this is, their true intentions here is, to, is trying to make sure that you're dealing with some kind of a despair, but that's in the reverse. Poverty. Okay, confirmation. This person is false, fake, and phony. Somebody's phony as hell. Somebody pretends really, really well here. This is what I'm hearing, Gemini. Somebody knows that your person loves you to the core, and their intention is to rob, steal, and destroy. They may be paying of somebody to make sure that it's 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 over. This could be uh they somebody went to a witch, which is a male witch, to make to to try to end something, to ruin something here. But karma is a b i t c h. Okay, what goes around comes around. I'm hearing this property is going back to sender. That's on period. And that karma goes back to sender. The gifts is coming right towards you. Change, happiness here. While they're getting bad health. Working hard over time here. And no change is coming towards them because they got their hands dirty. Trying to do spell work on somebody that don't want to be with them. However this person is. Stone cold loser. Weirdo. Man, oh man. This person sits down and try to figure out how to make sure that you stay hurt. No matter what the cost. No matter what the price. No matter if they go to hell, they don't care. Because their intentions is bad. The side piece. Okay? Side piece forever. This person wants to be a side piece forever. My goodness. Thank you, angels, for that confirmation. Tell me more. I just can't get enough of that sweet love. Okay, does that pipe that side piece? I told you. This side piece just cannot get enough of what they want. That sweet love. Maybe your person is one of those persons who's really good and bad here. And they got a piece of that pie and loved it. And now they want more and more and more. Now they're trying to have some kind of reconciliation. Maybe your person is torn. Somebody seems to be really torn here. Maybe they try to walk away from that side person to be with you. And they keep doing that spell work over and over. It's, it's, it's spitting the sky. It falls in your face. Because somebody's about to get their heart broken here. Because they're doing witchcraft. Black magic. 
It wasn't meant to be. He just said it wasn't meant to be. Hmm. Angels of ending. So the angels are ending this situation. Because this situation is evil, dirty, creepy, and crony. Take it a day at a time. Just watch the angels work. Because somebody's a pervert. And they're about to be feeling very ashamed. If they have not already. Because being around this person is intoxicating. Just being around them is intoxicating. Okay? Because somebody's under is an undercover lover here. And just saying, they try to copy and paste your life. They're watching you, stalking you, spying on you from a distance here. What's next? Creepy weirdos. That's into their intentions are bad. I thought you were my soulmate. You thought this person was your soulmate, but in all reality, somebody went to something. Somebody invested time in a in a snake. And this snake is an undercover spell doer. Okay. That's about to get their karma. Love it but hate you. Somebody's either trying to get out of a situation but don't know how to. Stand up for yourself. And some of you need to confront your fears here because this person is about to confess. Whoever that is, because their decision really hurt. Bad decisions. Everything takes time. You have to be patient with yourself. Just watch out for that fake smile that's coming towards you. Somebody around you is coming towards you with a fake smile. You have to be very careful with that person because they're full service and they cause nothing but damn stress in your life. That's on period. Somebody's stressful as hell. You're trying to make peace with this entire situation and somebody's just out to rob, seed and destroy. But it's not too late to turn around, okay? Somebody needs to turn around here. What is this? I feel connected to you like no other. I've had here. This person likes you. This person loves you. This person wants you. It's you that they want. But they're confused by demonic spell works. I just can't get enough of, of that sweet love. This person loves to, they love to make love to you. They love to touch on you. They love to kiss you. And, and, and they love the way that you make love to them. Well, honey, there's something that's causing this person not to come closer towards you. Somebody either knows this already. Your intuition already kicked in. You're feeling this. You're knowing this or whatever. Let's go on. This could be a water sign. A cancer who's doing this. For some of you, this could be a Scorpio or Pisces. This person may have a pet. Or they may already be dealing with, with health issue. This is who this person is. Somebody is dealing with health issue here. Whoever this person is who's doing this, they're already dealing with health issues. That This is their karma. This is their payback for doing what they're doing. Someone else. I told you, third party. Someone is in the middle of something. And someone is trying to sabotage this. Okay? Somebody wants to go on a vacation but it failed. Somebody either was planning something. This water sign that has this pet. This person may already didn't. If they didn't have this pet, they're thinking about getting one. This water sign. Okay. But now you have to move with caution here. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself about it or stress yourself. You have to be have patience here. Just a few more months into the saying that good things come to those who wait. And not to those who wait too late. Okay? Trust your intuition moving forward. But it's time that you move. Some kind of moving is in effect here. Change of residence. Moving in with your partner. Someone wants to move in with their person or something. Someone is thinking about moving forward here with someone. But you have to trust your intuition because angels are saying that the red flags you ignore will come back to bite you later. 
So somebody needs to see a situation for what it truly is here. It could be someone who makes it feels like you're on a honeymoon, honeymoon or dealing with a honeymoon phase or, or a wedding or, or what, I don't know, something. All right. But then on the other hand, I feel like this person is dealing with their sexuality. Someone is dealing with their sexuality here. If this is not you, then this is them. Someone is still trying to figure themselves out here. Or whatever that could be. But someone is trying to figure something out. Either on shore or just like both ways. This could be a, a fire sign. I feel like this fire sign could just really want to kind of set themselves free, Gemini. Okay, Leo Sag. Okay, so I'm hearing like there's no communication though. Because this communication is in the reverse. Things are getting out of control here with this communication that's not coming in. Someone is not trying to say what they really want to say or someone is holding on to the truth. Yep. But someone is moving. Someone is either about to move in a new home or relocating or they're trying to really resonate with your ancestors, your spirit guides, the universe is trying to lead you into this change. All right. A lost love or one who's okay. So there's definitely your answer. Yes, yeah, somebody's watching you. Ancestors, spirit guides, your angels, the universe, they're watching you carefully. They're guiding you. This ancestor could have been a Taurus or Virgo or a Cap. That's really trying to protect you. Ten more. I'm hearing that somebody's about to either go on a date or you're thinking about going out on a date or you're getting ready to just be wine and dine by someone here. Clarify this, please. What is it that I need to share, please, with gems? Next 48. Take it how it resonates with you because it won't resonate for every single one of you guys. All right, so this date may be concerning you going out gambling or it could be going to a casino or someone is just a very heavy spender here. Um... What is this? What is this? Or maybe this person that you're going out with really doesn't know how to balance their finances or this is you. Somebody doesn't know how to balance their finances here. Time that you move on. Somebody's moving on here. Someone is on unavailable. A waste of time. It is over with that person, but they will be back. This person is not over you yet, or this is you. Expect to hear from them soon. Someone wants to move on. Someone is unavailable, but someone is still in the energy, though. Someone is not over with a situation just yet. Tell me more for gems, please. Pregnancy. So there may be a, a baby here or someone is finding out that they're pregnant or about to or want to be. This may have something to do with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. For some of you, this could be a Libra. But somebody's lying though. I feel like for some of you, you're about to find out about this lie that's been told. Your next 48. Maybe the promise might have been a comfort to a fool as far as this person taking you out somewhere and doing something. Maybe this person is already married. Maybe this person told you that they were going to be divorced, but they're not. I'm hearing confession. So someone is about to tell you something. This person may be ready to spill the damn beans. Might have opened your heart with this person. Or maybe you need to because I feel like it will help you to attract new love. For some of you, that's what you really need. New love. Someone else. Something else. Clarify that, please. 
confession. Spinning the beans. I feel like somebody's somebody's just tired of holding a lie in. I feel like it's like taking a toll. Somebody needs to really come clean. Don't know how to. Tell me more. What's the message for gems, please? Next 48. All right, so this person has a huge ego. I'm hearing divine intervention is stepping in because this person has a massive ego here. Mercy shall follow you. I'm hearing victory. Mercy shall follow you. Victory. Divine intervention is at play. High divine alignment is coming true. It's telling me that your life is calling for protection because you're definitely dealing with a third party situation that is calling causing conflicts. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Okay. For some of you, you know, the sun is just not there in your life right now. You feel like everything is dark. You're going through some kind of a dark patch here. But high divine power here is having me feel like there's no ending right now. You, you're really trying to find peace. You're trying to find love. You're trying to find your purpose. But you're going through a storm warning that is uh, affecting your romance. It's making someone around you feel weak or this is you. It's causing something very mental. Or if this is not them again, then this is you. But someone is very playful in your energy because they're choosing to journey alone or this should be you. What's the next 48? What's the next 48, please? Okay, so for some of you guys, you're ready to rebuild your life, your structure here. It's just what I'm seeing. Rebuilding my energy. For some of you, just moving on, or you really want to, because you're dealing with a very painful transition here that's causing disagreement and conflicts. Somebody's just not seeing eye to eye, or somebody's making things difficult than it really should be. I'm never coming back to that pain. Someone wants to walk away because you're finally seeing your self-worth here, but action is needed. I'm also hearing gossips only hurt more because of these conflicts. So somebody's just talking, but someone really needs to be moving on and letting these talks go. For some of you, you just need to wait for a sign from the divine. Wait on your divine for the sign. Intuition speaks to you loud and clear as far as balance and truth is concerned because it's coming. This, this could be from a friend. For some of you, you may have a friend that's trying to help you to kind of walk you through a dark patch right now in your life. This could be a bloodline person. But for some of you, somebody may have abused their power, whoever this person is. Somebody abused their power with you. And now they're feeling conflicted and now they're feeling hurt and now they're feeling guilty. For some of you, this person who's feeling guilty, is the, this is the person who's journeying alone or wants you to be on a journey alone. Secret scandals and lies. That's your confirmation. Secret scandals and lies here. Choose love, not fear, because whatever this is, is causing illusion here. Hear your divine. Move forward, push forward, keep going. And just wash your hands and growth for this painful transition that you're going through. And these conflicts. Because that person is filled with nothing but guilt. Guilty as hell for being weird. Okay. Take your sadness away. And just saying that they love you. You need to take your sadness away. You was not born to be sad. So somebody is either wanting to be wanting you to deal with fear, but you're fearless. 
this could be separation that's trying to have you deal with fear, but you're fearless regardless. Action is needed though because this storm warning has to end, okay? You're definitely tapped into a runner energy. This is an attachment. Um, someone may be trying to have you remember love, but you need not to worry because this person is playful. I'm hearing good karma is coming towards you, but you have to reach out for the possibilities are endless. Divine power is saying that you need to be journeying alone right now. Past life issues, calling for transformation and prayer. Seek your divine. Um, you should not be abused. Dealing with sadness, dealing with tears or pain. It's time for you to move on. Wait on the divine. Angels are saying that balance and truth is coming towards you. Okay? But you have to hear and you have to move with the flow. Even though it's a painful transition, it's calling for a new start. To find peace with God. Because you don't want to go back to this pain. You're moving on. You're free from fear. Angels are taking away your sadness. Whatever sadness you're going through right now, Geminis. Angels are determined to take away your fear. They are. Where's my tarot deck? We're going to clarify some things here. You have an angel here, please. What's the angel here, please? Next 48 hours for Gemini's, please. What's the angel here to clarify? What's the angel here, please? All right, so we have the angels of a power oh my goodness look at that the angels of power the angels of power will be the 26th angel in line okay that's your angel here thank you angels of power for coming through to assist me with this reading um we appreciate you Clarify these messages, please. For gems. Just clarify these messages for gems at this time. Tap it into the energy of Gemini and your person, angels of power. The 26th angel divine. Tap it into the energy of Gemini and their situation. All those that are attached, please. The message for gems. Please clarify, please. Angels of power, please clarify these messages for gems, please. Temperance in the reverse. What is the temperance in the reverse? Temperance in the reverse is the king of cups. In the upright, um, the emperor. The ten of pentacles in the reverse the ace of swords in the upright one more uh, what you didn't see coming in the back of the deck was the, the sun the sun and the moon in the reverse i feel like for some of you guys you definitely have to release your fear here Especially because you're really attached to nonsense and people who are crazy and having you pulled into energies that that is attached to third party arguments, pain, or whatever this is. Okay, um, you have to be um, optimistic right now and just start with forgiveness. Just releasing what needs to be released. This is what I'm hearing for some of you guys. I feel like you know this Libra really might have hurt somebody here. Okay. Or maybe it could be this Pisces that's lying. Somebody's just lying here. But a lie is causing fear. And the lie is causing unhappiness. And the lie is causing confusion. And something is coming into the open. Because somebody is weird and somebody is weirder. 
Okay. I'm hearing success and positivity is coming towards you. This is what I'm seeing on the back of the deck for you guys, okay? What you didn't see coming. Mm-mm-mm. I feel like for some of you guys, though, it's just, you know, it's all about your intuition at this point. Using your intuition to move forward. Using the intuition to listen to the angels directing your path here, okay? As far as um your vision is, as far as your success is, as far as your goals is, as far as your manifesting what you really need, gems, okay? Um, you know, you're dealing with a lot of things right now because the temperance is definitely in the reverse, okay? Uh, whatever your imbalanced situation is, it's caused because someone is not using their intuition wisely, okay? And not only do I feel that you're not, I, I'm seeing this King, King of Cups energy that is coming through that's telling me that, you know, for some of you guys, you're dealing with an emotional balance here or someone that's just trying to be very controlling because this control, I feel like you're ending this control, okay? Because we have the Six of Cups in the back, the deck that's in the reverse. So someone doesn't want to go back to that. Someone doesn't want, doesn't live here anymore. The sun and the six of cups in the reverse. Happiness, withdrawal, unsurety, not returning to sadness and pain here. You have an emperor energy that is coming through. You might have met someone or you're about to lose someone here. Okay? Because something has maybe been put on hold. Something needs alignment, something needs raw power, something needs peace, something needs clarity with this ace of swords here. Why do I feel like someone is either just not moving fast enough or not seeing a situation for what it really truly is or just over in investing into something that's not investing into you, it's not working, it's, it's just setbacks from one setback to the next setback to the constant setbacks. Clear thinking is either because you're very intelligent, okay? But you have to use your power and with authority. The King of Swords. The King of Swords, the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse, the Ace of Swords in the upright. Use an authority here. Listen to your own tr truth. What is this? The Hangman. The Nine of Wands in the reverse. If this is not you, then this is definitely them because somebody's on the edge here. It's like London Bridge is burning down and someone is yet to see that it's burning down. Somebody's either been very defensive or weird, stupidity. Or somebody's just dealing with, with, with just being paranoid about whatever. But someone is just not wanting to let go. Somebody's just not letting go. I feel like, you know, if this is not you, Gems. You might have already invested or made a lot of sacrifices here. But something is not setting stone. The lovers in the reverse and again, the sun, the sun, the three of swords. So there's a lot of healing that's taken a very long. This healing is like it's going and it's going and it's going like a train on a track here. But it's all about a lack of foresight here. So somebody's just wailing, wasting time. They're sitting at the top of the deck, wasting time, dealing with obstacles. When you should be dealing with long-term goals. This is why your energy is in the reverse. The empress in the up in, in the reverse. In the reverse. Emotional loss, having people making promises, fake promises, tapping into energy, giving passion in one aspect, not giving passion in the other. Action is needed here, but someone is out being adventurous here. Very impulsive, but someone is also dealing with some kind of a karma or karmic situation, life cycle karmic, that doesn't should live here anymore. Someone needs to be moving away from something but having a hard time letting go. Someone wants to come back, but still not want to let go what needs to be let go so that way you could have a sense of peace to make a decision to move on to an emperor. Action is needed where someone needs to take their power back. That's for sure. Because promises are meant to be broken. This is what I'm hearing. Clarify that promise, please. The Five of Swords. That's in the reverse. Somebody needs to be open to change. Something different for once in your life. Because a past situation is, is really pulling in resentment here at this point with this Five of Swords in the reverse. Okay? That's on period. 
change needs to happen and it has to happen now because someone has already invested too much here. If a promise is coming in, the promise has to be set in stone. That's on period. If it's not set in stone, that you can't deal with that because this person is going to have one foot out and one foot in. Okay. All right. This is going to be your next 48 hours, Gems. Um, I hope that it did resonate with you. Please do not hesitate to give it a thumbs up on your way out. Um, let me know if you do need a prayer request. Simply by leaving your initials down in the comment section. Claim also divine intervention in your life. Tap that into the comment section as well. If you do need to have a prayer request for a friend or family, let me know that you need one. All I ask of you guys is to pray for me as I'm also praying for you. And with that said, always remember to see first and you always find. I'll see you in your next one, okay? Bye, guys.